Hi everyone, it's Chastity here. Welcome back to my nursery. So I kind of wanted to give you guys an update on my collection and show the babies that I have now and my little bit of uh, nursery setup. So oh, I'm sorry my finger waving in there how I got my phone. So of course we have baby Oliver here and he is on a boppy um and this is the aussie by priscilla lopes so this one was painted by natalia schuyler so there he is he's the newest one that came into my collection and then he's on a bin of clothes these are um kate quinn in here and then i have girls um clothes in there so then we come over here and this is my crib and this crib was actually my son's crib so you can see kind of teeth marks there um because for whatever reason babies like to chew on their cribs when they're standing up and my son had an oral pro sensory problem so um he well, this was my two youngest sons, so, um, that are now six and seven. So this was their crib and the bedding, the Winnie the Pooh bedding that is under here. So you can see, um, is actually was my 15 year old son's bedding from his crib so i don't have his crib any longer but i do have the bedding so this is his bedding and um this is the new pillow i just have it sitting in here and that's some couple stuffed animals and you know i have like extra saran wrap for under heads and um rooted babies and some brushes and stuff like that just some random stuff and this is a little uh, monkey baby that I got that I had bought second hand so I actually have this guy up for sale on Reborns I'm surprised that nobody actually bought this one I mean for the price I have him up there um you would have think like he would have went by now um like have him $100 plus shipping is really not a bad deal for that um being that he is hand painted and rooted and glass eyes so what can you do anyways the so uh, blankets that are on back are crocheted blankets that i got with my two oldest so this one came with my 15 year old son i got this at my baby shower for him and then this one is my gonna be 25 year old daughter's that I had gotten um, at a baby shower for her. So, yeah, that's how long I've had these ones. So, here we have Miss Laura. Sorry if the lighting's a little dark. It's kind of dark in here. It's an overcast day and my blinds closed. I don't get good natural light um, over where I shoot my videos on my bed. is much more like a brighter light lighting over there so if it looks a little dark i apologize for that but here we have laura so she is my laura by bonnie brown she's just chilling on my bobsy bobby right now it's the lounger one the lounger and then aussie was on the nursing bobby that was actually my sons my five and or six six and seven year old sons Bobby. And then here we have Skya, my cuddle baby that I painted myself. So she is chilling here too with Laura. She needs a change. I put her into this a while ago. I don't know why I don't change her more often. She's a cuddle. I can change her as much as I want, really. So then we'll come over to here to the bassinet. So I have little Tate. Tate is my Chase by Bonnie Brown. And he is just 
lounge it in the bassinet. So there he is. He's still in that sleeper. I changed him in. He's just kind of right here. And when I like, I don't want to like have him open. I just put this up over him. Um, I do like to cover my dolls. Um, especially like in the evening time, I'll cover them and stuff like that. Just so they don't get dusty. Um, also too, I uncovered them for this video. I usually don't have them uncovered a lot unless I'm actually displaying that doll for whatever reason but if I want to have one out let's say it like that so over here is my bins of clothes I'm still working on getting more organized and stuff like that but like up top here still has some random stuff this has got my COAs and stuff like that stuff that you know, or for the dolls that come with the dolls. And then the bins. Like I have Kate Quinn. This is my newest Kate Quinn starting bin. I'm going to transfer this one out for the girl bin that's over there. Just because that way that one will all be Kate Quinn. Um, and then this is boys, girls. And then down here I have like accessories, headbands, mitts, hats, stuff like that. Booty, socks, pacifiers. I just have a lot of accessories in there. Then this bin here is three to six month clothes and maybe a little bit bigger. But this is all for a bigger baby, um, which I do not have right now in my collection. But this is what this bin is. And that's minus um, Kate Quinn because Kate Quinn is actually in the girl Kate Quinn bin over at the other one. So I have just one bin full of girl Kate Quinn. That's it. Mostly what I buy is what I consider for the boys. But I do have more boys than girls. This is boys clothes here. Another bin of boys. As you can see, I have lots of boy clothes. And then we have over here, this is my Kate Quinn. Two, these two bins are all full of clothing. And then this one here is the accessories, hats, head headbands, um, booties, bibs, stuff like that are in this bin here. And they're all pretty full. That's why I had to start another one. And then I have like blankets and stuff like this just piled up. And I have a clothing haul that I'm going to be showing once I get my other stuff. And then down here is my chair with Baby Max in it. So here is the newest chair that I got. It's a little rocker. And it has a toy bar, but, you know, for them, I do not use it. Um, There's a box, like, over here. That's just extra clothing. I'm not even really going to show that because it is um, not for any purpose. I don't have a lot of clothes in there that maybe a few pieces that I keep will keep for my personal collection. But that's kind of clothes that I've been weeding out for um, dolls that I sell and send home. I'll generally pull from that box. But that's mostly like stuff that... I don't really use a whole lot of like carters and stuff like that so anyways um under oh under here i just have some lovies and my receiving blankets and stuff like that under the bassinet and that's kind of it that's my space for the for the dolls over in the corner like over there you can see like there's my tripod um there's a light over there and then diapers are in that corner over there. But um, that's kind of all <laughs> I, I have for my non-painting space. My non painting space is a mess. This is my non-painting space. This is just my space for my dolls. Um, and I'm very fortunate enough to have somebody that is supportive enough to allow me to have that space because this is in our bedroom but he um 
you know, he he's not too, he, he don't care too much. It makes me happy. So he's supportive of it um, and knows that what else are we going to be using this space for? So anyways, this guy, I'm just got to pine on him because he's, he's my favorite. <laughs> he's just fabulous and he looks so good in this little rocker. So this is kind of his seat for now. Um, I did have the newest baby in here and took a couple pictures. I had him in here while I had Max out on the, um, bed on the, um, that new positioner thing that I had him laying out on for a little while last night. And then I switched him around and put Max back here because this is kind of just, he just looks really cute in this seat. So, anyways, um, I'm gonna get off here. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing this, um, little video and a little, um, look into my collection. And, yeah, I'm, that's about all. <laughs> uh, you guys have a good day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.